Right, so uh, welcome to this little video. Um, this is to announce the winners of the competition that I uh, held last month uh, to win pairs of tickets to the NEC Motorhome and Caravan Show um, this coming month. Right. Be being the 1st of October now, <laughs> and the competition, the competition closed. closed at midnight. Yeah, midnight yeah. yesterday, yeah. so I thought yeah. we'll get this over and, and done and let you know who, who are the winners. Um, so I asked how many questions? I asked five questions. No, <laughs> it was quite tricky of me, wasn't it really? Five questions for five pairs of tickets. So the first question I asked was, what are the dates of the Motorhome and Caravan Show 2019 at the NEC Birmingham? And that's the 15th of October to the 20th of October. Are you not reading that at all? No, I, I know it off by heart. That's Tuesday to Sunday. Right, okay. Uh, second question I ask, and this is quite important because there's no point having a free ticket if you can't go. No. Are you able to attend the show on one of these days? Yes. Good. <laughs> what was the launch event I attended at the Motorhome and Caravan Show in 2018? That was the Bailey Alliance range launch. Okay, and question four was, what coach-built motorhome did I say was the winner of the best compact motorhome in 2018? Now, few people got this wrong because it wasn't what uh, some people thought it was because different people had different best compact motorhomes. What I said was the best compact motorhome was the Escape, the Swift Escape Compact C402. Right. You got that? Oh, that's what did I did. You get that right? Yeah, I did. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Right at the end of the video, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And I, finally, I asked, "What stand will our friend Aileen be on on Mackay Pet Supplies at the NEC show?" So she's in Hall Eleven. Yeah. Stand forty-four. Oh, you didn't look at that then. No, no, no. Just no, say no, it that's there. <laughs> <laughs> I know that as well. You know that off by yeah, heart. Um, yeah. Right. So if you got those correct answers, uh, congratulations, you're in the draw. Uh, I had 27 correct answers, about four or five incorrect answers, mainly on the um, what co coach built motor. Right. Okay. So I've put all the names in a in a bowl. Yeah. And I'm going to ask you to put, pull them out. I've just right. spent I spent about half an hour this morning cutting bits of paper up. Right, okay. So I'm glad I was doing something useful. We we're going to get Poppy to do this, but. I think it might be a bit too difficult. Technical for Poppy. Right, make sure you only pick one because they were sticking together earlier. Right, got right, one. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, keep going. Keep it's going, quite, okay. Quite a bit of paper. One. Right, the first one is Pauline and Barry Hawks. You don't read the email. No. So, Pauline and Barry Hawks, you're a winner. I'll just put that over there. Oops. Pick one with the other hand. No. No. Okay. Next one. That's not fair, is it? To, is it not? to use the same hand. Okay. Right. So this is David Scadding. Sc Scadding. Scadding. Oh, Scadding. I would say. Yep. Yep. Okay, David, you're you're a winner. So three to go. Isn't it? Three to go. You want to use the other hand? Yeah, use the other hand just for effect. Might be easier using the other hand. Uh, Derek and Alison from Sheffield. I think that's um, Alison Mountain. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so congratulations. Is that three? Three. It's all high tech stuff here yeah. with this bowl. <laughs> Marion Irvine. Okay, yeah. So that's four. This is the last La one. Last pair of tickets. Da -da 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 -da. Phil and Tammy, that's Phil Green. All right, okay. So that's five tickets, five pairs of tickets. What I will do is I'll email where you get your tickets from. You ha actually need to go to the NEC. It will be at the, the press office to, to pick them up. I will let um, the organizers know that you're coming and they will send you some details uh, exactly where the press office is and everything. So right. I think I think that's it. All I was going to do, I'll just put that bowl aside, I don't know why I'm sitting here with a bowl. <laughs> All I was going to do is, there's an interesting bit in Practical Motorhome this month. Uh, I'm not sponsored by Practical Motorhome yeah, or anything, no. it's just a magazine we no. buy. And it's all about the different vans that, that are, the, are there. 
and uh, there is a little bit of information there and I'll just read it to you because I thought it was quite useful it was how to see the show it says when it's open when is it open I think we all know that by now 15th to the 20th of October what time though we haven't said what time it's what day it's, it's uh, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. every day right. on those days it says where can I find the show it's at the NEC Birmingham surprisingly which if you put a post if you want a postcode is B40 one NT and it's in halls 6 to 12 and 17 to 20 it's the biggest show of the year there's a lot of walking isn't it? and there's an awful lot of walking yeah. so bring your walking shoes um, big uh, problem um, last year and not quite a bigger problem this year is where can I park parkings included in the price of the ticket but note that no overnight parking is allowed other than on the designated campsite. Next question is where can I camp at the site? And there is a motorhome, a caravan and motorhome club site running a temporary campsite for the show and that opens the day before on Monday the 14th of October and they reduce the pitch allocation for that from 400 to 199. Wow, so, so it's almost half. Halved then. it, well Ooh. more than halved it. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, and they said uh, as of the second of September, that both the campsite and the waiting lists were full, so no chance of getting in on there. I would, I would guess. Um, there are several sites in the in the area you could try. Um, the there's Chapel Lane where we've stayed once before. Uh, I think when we looked at that, that was full. that's fully booked apart from Monday the fourteenth. I mean, we used to do that, go up on the Monday, yeah. stay there overnight and go to the show Tuesday, the Tuesday. didn't we? Yeah. Or Sunday, I think, was free, the Sunday after yeah. the show, but everything else there, service pitches, non-standard with awnings, standard yeah. pitches, they're all fully booked. Right, OK. Uh, the, other, the other site from one of the, the other club is Camping and Caravanning Clubs, Kingsbury Water, that's 17 minutes drive can't tell if that's fully booked no because they don't do yeah. they don't show you online you just have to no. either ring the site I probably suppose, best or to ring the site see if they've got anything and the other site at summer's wood is also fully booked and it actually has a waiting list of 20 as they went to press so goodness knows what it is now no, no. so my advice if you're going to the show is either to park at, get there early park up at the free parking uh, there is plenty of room for motorhomes if you get there early mm. uh, and you leave your motorhome the, during the day and you can come and go backwards and forwards that's to the motorhome. That's what we used to do. We that's what we used to do. Day, yeah. If you haven't yeah. already booked a campsite, that's yeah. definitely the best thing to do. Mm. Uh, it, if, you, if you didn't win the tickets or didn't get any free tickets anywhere else, uh, it, day tickets cost £9.50 for adults, £13 on the door, uh, £8.50 for seniors, and £12 on the door and children and care as a company a registered disabled visitor go free and you can buy them online at uh, mcshow.co.uk and there's a transaction fee of £1.25 for that and they've got loads of other stuff on there as well so there's cookery demos, expert talks, uh, TV chefs, um, Country Files, Helen Skelton, and much more. And there's uh, tuition in motorhome manoeuvring. That's not easy to say, is it? <laughs> motorhome right. manoeuvring. Uh, also, Practical Motorhome, I've got ten, 10 pairs of tickets to give away as well. So it might be worth getting a copy of Practical Motorhome. You never know, you might win a competition for free tickets there as well. Will you put all these details in there? details below what in the details below <laughs> bit <laughs> that bit down there <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah we'll do we'll do so um i think that's about it that's about it yeah have i forgotten anything i don't think so no oh, i'm going to go through there and see what bands yeah we want to look at yeah i suppose it, it might be worth just saying whilst whilst we're looking at that we are going to make a list of, of bands to look at ourselves just really going through this list but if you've got any bands you'd like us to look at assuming they are at the show yeah um let us know and someone else said we don't review caravans well we'll review caravans if people ask us to yeah it's just in the past people have said well you a motorhome channel they well, can, I, I, and there's plenty of caravan yeah. bloggers we've thought that it's best yeah. they yeah concentrate on caravans yeah. but if you like our style of review yeah uh, then we love, we love going in caravans yeah don't yeah, we? yeah 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 <laughs> yep so if you want anything you want us to look at what that's at the show um let us know. Right. 
Right, so that's it. I'll stop waffling. Yeah. Um, if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe and hit the notifications icon. And you'll get an update when our next video is released, which is a... Um, a, a living living test <laughs> living test of the router yeah, yeah living t we've living with it. living with the router that's it that's, that's it. it yeah, yeah we, we've been testing this netgear uh, mifi router and it's a bit of feedback from what we found when we were going around yorkshire with it yeah so watch out for that and we'll right. see you soon yep bye then bye then